<laughs> First fish of the day, another lures only day. I bamboozled one of them into taking the peanut butter and jelly in clear water. Ooh, looks like a nice one. Or at least decent, it's hard to tell. Oh, it's a walleye! I didn't even tell from over there. Oh my goodness. Look at that. Oh my gosh. That's fantastic. A legal walleye to start the day off. 15, I, I'd guess more like 16 inches. First cast with this brown plastic worm that I, uh, soft plastic that I rigged up and I got a smallmouth. Beautiful. See, I thought something new would fool him. It's not that big, but... He just a short shank hook and a, a sinking uh, soft plastic. Just twitch it a little, reel it in a little, and a nice little smallmouth. Beautiful. There you go, buddy. Looks like we got a small fish. Um, this time on the uh, Blue Fox Spinner with some fluorocarbon because um, it's a little largemouth. Isn't that cute? Huh. I'm going to cut a largemouth in a, in a little while. It's awesome. Cool. Largemouth in the river. There you go, buddy. Anyway, I have fluorocarbon leader on because um, the water's so clear. Another fish. And the blue fox spinner. A little smally. Yep. Hello, buddy. Oh. There he is. Pretty little guy. Another fish. Feels a little heavier than the last one. It's a small mouth. And you're giving some strong tugs for a for someone for a small mouth that isn't that big. Yeah, you're okay sized. Cool. That's awesome. Look at that guy, eh? That's not bad. It's over 13. 13 to 14-ish. On the Blue Fox Spinner again. Beautiful. Another another cast and another fish on the Blue Fox Spinner. Might be a little better than the last one even, maybe. Around the same size, or a little better. Oh, you're fat. Kind of, kind of fat. You, you're like tall. You got some tallness to you. But you got to be at least 14. That's great. We're, <laughs> we're going up. They're getting bigger. Beauty, eh? A small mouth on the uh, brown curly tail jig, 1 8 ounce head. Very natural looking color in this clear water. Oh. Not very big though, that's okay. Maybe legal, he might hit 12. There you go. I might have found a nice lure here because two casts and two fish. Another smallmouth it looks like. And that same brown curly tail jig. Brownish. It's like brown olive. They really like this. A little, well, about the same size. Maybe a tiny bit smaller. There we go. Kind of swallowed it a little. There he is. Beautiful little smallmouth. Three cast, three fish. And a brown curly tail jig. Another smallmouth. Gorgeous. Man, isn't it pretty out today? It's overcast 
fall weather, so every all the all the colors get sort of grayed out a little. Man, I love fall. I have another pretty little smallmouth. There he is. Beautiful little guy. See ya. A few casts later and another fish. Looks like a smallmouth again. A little better in size, maybe. Maybe. Just a little, not much. Yep. A little better. 13, maybe a hair more, maybe 13 and a half, something like that. Two more casts and it looks like another smallmouth on that brown curly tail jig. And they're really hot for this jig. Fantastic. Come on in, pal. Not very large, but <laughs> not large at all, actually. He looked a little bigger out there than that. But that's alright. A smallmouth is a smallmouth. Just a sprinkle so far. Another fish. Is it a smallmouth? Yep. And that same brown curly tail jig. This one took a good amount of casts to get. That's okay. Still not that big though. Yeah, another little guy. Pretty though. It's raining again. I have another little smallmouth, I think. Yep. I'm get a little wet. That same brown curly tail jig. There he is. Pretty little guy. Another smallmouth, I think. And that brown, olive brown curly tail jig. A lot of little guys. Hmm. I saw a couple big guys cruising out there. Where are they? They fouled me up twice, but no luck. Another skinny guy. Oops, see ya. <laughs> Another smallmouth on the uh, brown and olive curly tail jig. Looks a little better. Definitely legal. A little weight to him. Oh, look at that other one going and uh, schooling up with him. See, there's three right there. Oh, they don't know what's going on right here. Yeah, you're not bad. Yeah. Heck yeah, you might be the best one so far today. Get this thing out of your lip and then voila. Well, probably tied for the best. Along with that other one earlier. Probably hit 14, I'd guess, maybe? Somewhere around there. Beautiful. There you go, buddy. Feels like another smaller smallmouth. And that brown olive jig. Can hork this one a little. Catching a lot of smallmouth today. Most of them are, almost all of them are small, but I bet we might catch a big one eventually, hopefully. 
Man, I hope so. <laughs> that one's really small. There you go, bud. I think maybe they're seeing the jig a little better now that the sun is out. Yeah, look at that guy. He's not bad. He might be 15 out there. This guy, I guess, a little guy, but he just followed this guy up. 15's not bad. 15 is a, it's a decent fish, man. This little guy, though, he puts the small in smally. Oh. I put on a uh, crayfish crankbait and first cast, and I have one. Feels like he has a little bit of weight to him. Perhaps, perhaps a little. Another decent one. Not so big, but not tiny. Yeah, actually kind of small. He felt heavier. I guess he's halfway felt hooked is why on the gill plate here. Now I'll un unhook him in a second, but there he is. A really small small mouth just took that crankbait. Whoa, whoa, whoa there, whoa there. A little ambitious, eh? I'll give him in a second, but there he is. Smallest one of the day so far. We're at the new spot, and we have a little fish to start us off here. Little fall fish? Interesting. And the, uh, well, this is a different um, olive-ish curly tail jig. Another fish on the next cast. Oh, looks like another largemouth bass. Just a small guy, but pretty. On this olive curly tail jig again. Oh, another fish. Not very large though, unfortunately. Another fall fish, that's what it is. Nice musky bait. But today is a lures only day, so you will go free. Oh. Another fish. It's a fall fish. There he is, just a little guy. Oh, another fish. It's a fall fish. <clears throat> that olive curly tail jig. There he is. See ya. He's wrapping himself in the uh, weeds. This one might be a smallie because he jumped. Yeah, it looks like a smallie. Another little bass. On the uh, olive curly tail jig, one eighth ounce. There he is. Another fish. Is it a little smally, perhaps? Or a fall fish? No, it's a fall fish. Feisty. Oh, there. And slippery. Jeepers. There we go. 
little guy goes back in. I think we got a little smallmouth right away on the blue fox spinner. Yeah, quite little, but that's all right. There he is. There he goes. Another little guy. Need a big guy already. Jeepers. Come on. Come on in, bud. Here we go. Little smallmouth bass. There we go. Little smallmouth bass. On the Senko. Oh. It's really hoping for bigger. Jeepers. Come on. Yeah, whatever, I'll get in a second. There he is. Just a little guy, again. That one on the Senko gun. Oh. Well, it doesn't feel tiny, but it doesn't feel large either. <laughs> By tiny, I mean like less than 12, but he might be tiny, actually. Jeepers. It's not that small of a bait. But, as we all know, they can eat stuff up to, or often eat, often attack stuff up to half their size, or maybe longer, depending on the fish, I guess. Okay, he's less than 12. Oh well, hopefully we'll catch a big one soon. Another little smallie. That feels like a better smallie. Come on, baby. Just make it in. I have a lot falling off the hook today. Oh, maybe it isn't that good. Darn it. Man, that felt better than it is. Jeepers. That guy felt way bigger. He felt like a 15. Shoot. Oh, well. There he is. Finally got one of them. <clears throat> Still not very big though. I think I'm going to move on to another spot. Had to change into this oversized hook because I lost some pretty decent ones, maybe almost 15 on the, on the smaller hook. It was really frustrating me. But anyway, another small fish. <laughs> We're at the new spot now. Another little smallmouth, jeepers. Oh my goodness. At least this one's probably barely legal. Jeepers. So many small ones. I'm sorry guys. I'll try to catch a big one before the uh, day is out. I really will. <laughs> of course, I have all the amazing fish in there. All the small mouse attack it and miss and I get the fall fish. Oh well. Look at those bass. It's a large fall fish. Ooh, a very large fall fish. Wow. Look at him. Jeepers. 
This is the last spot for today. <laughs> Another little smallmouth. Man, I just can't avoid them today. All the smallmouth have to be little ones, I guess. This time I'm on a 16th ounce um, creamish and black colored jig, curly tail. Oh, little smallmouth. There you go, bud. heck is it? Oh, I fell hooked a smallmouth in the gill plate. Oh, well, <laughs> another smaller guy. Cool. I threw on a micro jig just for the heck of it. Looks like I got a little perch. I don't know, maybe a 7 inch or so. Maybe somewhere around there. I don't know. Oh, I'll unhook him in a second, but there he is. Beautiful. Same micro jig. Bigger perch, maybe? Oh yeah, look at that beauty, eh? That's a nice one. That might be... If it isn't 10, it's close. That's awesome. <laughs> 